Perplexity just launched a new AI browser called Comet today, July 9th, 2025. But here's the catch. You need their $200 per month max subscription to get it. Before you close this video thinking it's just for rich tech enthusiasts, hear me out. This browser might show us exactly where the entire internet is headed. Google Chrome owns 68% of the browser market. That's nearly 7 out of every 10 people browsing the web. But a startup backed by Jeff Bezos and NVIDIA thinks they've found Chrome's weakness. It still makes you work like it's 1998. Think about how you use the internet right now. You type keywords, click links, open tabs, compare information across multiple sites, then repeat the whole process. We've gotten so used to this digital labor that we don't even question it anymore. Comment asks a simple question. What if your browser did the work instead of you? Here's what makes this different. Traditional browsers are windows to websites. Even Chrome with all its AI features is still fundamentally about showing you pages. Comet uses something called agentic AI, which means it can think, act, and make decisions for you. Instead of searching for information, you have a conversation. Instead of opening 20 tabs to plan a vacation, you tell Comet what you want and it handles the research. The Comet Assistant lives inside your browser watching what you're doing, not in a creepy way. Your data stays on your device and isn't used for training their models, but it jumps in when it can help. Reading a long article? It offers to summarize. Shopping for something? It compares prices across sites automatically. Got a meeting request in your email? It checks your calendar and schedules it. Everything happens naturally while you browse. They even built in this wild feature where you can upload a photo and virtually try on clothes before buying them. The AI handles the fitting room right in your browser. No more ordering three sizes and returning two. Perplexity built Comet on Chromium, so your Chrome extensions still work. But instead of being another Chrome clone, they made their AI search engine the core experience. When you open a new tab, you don't see a search box. You start a conversation. The early access program uses invite codes to keep things under control during the holiday summer. By 2026, it's set to become a widely accessible tool for everyone. Privacy is where they made some bold choices. Three modes to pick from, completely ad-free with no memory, memory enabled without ads, or full memory with ads if you want free access eventually. Your browsing data stays local. Compare that to Chrome, which basically turns your digital life into Google's AI training data. The timing couldn't be more perfect. OpenAI just added search to ChatGPT. Google's pushing AI overviews everywhere. Microsoft baked Copilot into Edge. Everyone's racing to be the AI browser, but they're all just adding AI features to traditional browsers. Perplexity did the opposite. They built an AI that happens to browse the web. This changes how we interact with information online. Complex research that takes hours becomes one conversation. Price comparisons happen automatically. Your browser transforms from a tool into an assistant that actually assists. Those 50 tabs you have open right now? Comet would handle that research in a single chat. Perplexity isn't some garage startup either. Founded in 2022, they hit a 14 billion valuation and handle over 100 million queries weekly. With backing from Jeff Bezos, SoftBank, and NVIDIA, plus over $500 million in funding, they have serious resources. Will this kill Chrome? Probably not overnight. Google's 68% market share is massive, and they're not going down without a fight. But Perplexity doesn't need to beat Chrome. They just need to show enough people there's a better way. Once you experience AI-first browsing, going back to traditional search feels ancient. What's really happening here is bigger than just another browser launch. We're watching the shift from searching the internet to conversing with it. Instead of being hunters clicking through links, we become directors telling our AI what we need. The web transforms from a library where you find books to an assistant who reads them for you. For anyone exhausted by tab management, manual price comparisons, or hours spent researching simple questions, Comet offers a glimpse of what's coming. A future where your browser doesn't just show you the internet, 
It understands what you're trying to accomplish and helps you get there. The $200 price tag might seem steep, but it's really a preview of where all browsers are headed. The question isn't if AI will transform browsing, but which company will lead that transformation. What do you think? Is this the future or just another expensive tech experiment? Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video.